to my channel. Thank you for tuning in. I'm so excited. I just love doing these films. I just love to record. I love to upload to YouTube. I am so excited to be doing it again. So as you can see by the title, I am decorating my YouTube studio, aka my spare room. I'm going to be DIYing a selfie mirror and a lot of other stuff just to make it look very chic and um, very designer, which it actually is not. So if you want to see how I actually create that illusion, then please keep watching. So here I am at the, in the afternoon, I was going to say at the end of the day, it's the afternoon, I'm, ooh, how, what time are we at? Let's just check the time. It's only 3.25 and I have a glass of wine in my hand, is that bad? I don't normally drink this early, I just thought I need a bit of Dutch courage to tackle this project. As you can see I got changed as well, I'm wearing my dress that I wore today and I just threw a cap on because we went down the beach, it was lovely and sunny, oh, it was beautiful. So I'll not drink this, I'll just have a sip, I'll, yeah, I didn't realise how early it was. So if you want to know what I'm drinking, it's this Magic Box Cabernet. So let's get into this video. Okay guys, so these are the things I'm going to use today in order to decorate the bedroom. So I went to Ikea and I bought a very long mirror. So I'm going to be putting this on this wall here above my shoes and to make it into a beauty mirror I bought uh, seven of these LED lights that you just push and you actually just stick them on the wall so I'm going to stick them around the mirror and I'm going to pop some batteries in them um, so that it kind of gives the illusion of being like a, a beauty mirror and I bought these um, lights they're like fluffy lights I got them from Ikea too and I'm gonna put them around these these are individual wooden effect pictures and I'm gonna put them above the bed there and I'm gonna hang the lights on them and I bought this this was I think 250 from Ikea and I'm just gonna print some designer labels off just print them off Google and just pop them inside here. Um, yeah, let's tackle it and see how this turns out. Let's get into it, darlings. Woo! So this is the room before. Let's let's just show you a pan of the room before. Ignoring the mess in the corner. Um, I've just got my husband to put the hook in ready to hang this baby. So next, I'm going to use some of this wire to wrap around each side so that I can hang it securely. So let's get one side in. Push it in. Pull it across. Now I like to do a few layers of this just to be sure that it isn't going to fall. So I'll wrap around again. So I've wrapped it around lots and lots and lots just to make sure it is secure. It feels very secure. Excited but scared. So guess what's up? Eee, look at it. It looks awesome. It's huge. It's amazing. So what we're going to do now is we're going to make it into a beauty mirror. 
We're going to stick the lights all the way around the outside and make it look fabulous. There it is from a distance. It actually makes the room look bigger. How fantastic is that? Loving it. So let's get these lights out of the packets and with batteries in and we'll stick them around the mirror and see what that looks like. Okay guys, so I've just put the batteries into all of these and that was a lot of batteries. <laughs> so these were $4 each from Ikea and they all come with a sticky backing. So I'm gonna place the sticky backing onto the back of each one and then I'm gonna pull the other side off and then I'm gonna stick it around the mirror. So I'm going to put three on one side, three on the other and one at the top. Okay, now here's for the first one. Where shall I put it? Where shall I put it? It really doesn't want to focus. There we go. So, hmm, maybe here, right in the center. Let's try that. So I've stuck it on <laughs> and it looks all on its lonesome so I better get the other ones on let's see how bright that goes wow yikes that is so bright wow oh that's awesome let's get the rest on <coughs> guys I'm so excited look how it turned out How cool does that look? <gasps> Let's go and switch the lights on. Oh, I spend thousands on a beauty mirror. Oh, that one's high. Oh, that's too high. Why then spend thousands on a beauty mirror when you can spend under a hundred? I'll have to switch the top one on. Guys, short person problems. I'll have to use a stool to switch the top one on. Look at these, wow. I'm quite impressed with the brightness. Really quite impressed. Okay, so for the next project, I have above the bed to do. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to get these out of the pack I'm gonna separate them and I'm going to get them hung above the bed. And then we'll set the twinkly lights onto them and see how that looks. Hey guys, so I'm just gonna chirp in on this bit. I actually tried to decorate a book and make it into kind of a designer book, but it didn't work. It didn't work. The reason why it didn't work was because I tried to use super glue and super glued the letters to my fingers. Whew. Okay, so I'm going to be real with you. Um, didn't quite turn out the way I expected. I didn't get the books done properly the way I wanted to. I did manage to, I'll just turn you round, I did manage to get one of the books done in a sparkly silver, but I couldn't stick the, um, the designer label on because the super glue actually stuck to my fingers and I got super glue on my fingers. <laughs> so I've just put my sparkly book underneath the plant. I am going to get a little tab, side table or something to put him on, but I haven't done that yet. So I already did this. I had a silver picture frame and I just printed this print off Google. I just searched up Chanel and I just printed it off um, the Google site. It was just A4 and I hung that up there in between my little shelving units. I already had my goals board there, which you've seen. And I showed you this on my very extra Kmart haul. So above the bed, I've put the 
three pictures that I said I was going to put up there just now. That was a challenge, I tell you. And then I put my little string lights above there just to light, lighten that area up, to brighten it up a bit. I'm gonna pan quickly past my makeup area because that's a mess. And then we've got our beauty mirror in the corner with the lights all around. So I think in the main, it has turned out pretty well. I think it looks, I'll just go around here. I think it looks pretty smart excuse the little bit of mess there so this is the vanity beauty mirror here and it just makes the room look really big it's absolutely beautiful so pretty cheap way of doing it lovely in here not quite how I wanted it with the Gucci and the Prada and all that but I still got a few things that reference um, designer dotted around just goes to show that things might be harder than we expect because it took me a lot longer than I thought it would so guys I'm so sorry it was such a random um, video i've got it's probably all over the place so i'm going to try and piece it together as best i can to make it um to make it look as good as i can okay so i am really pleased the way it turned out and i hope you enjoyed me trying as much as i could to diy i um yeah i look forward to seeing you in the next one and Thank you for watching if you liked it please give it a, a thumbs up and please subscribe and click that notification bell to see what else i may upload in the future i really really enjoy what i'm doing i'm actually filming something tomorrow which i'm also excited about um so stay tuned for that i'm going to be reviewing a product so um stay tuned for that and i look forward to seeing you in the next one bye